No intro sketch today. You mad? You just got trolled! Bitch. damn garage comedy talk show here on YouTube. I'm Joe Trass. Miguel Gerona. I'm Corey. I'm Royce. Holy shite, he said his name! You said, said your name! Ha! He's Yay! Always, he's always said his name. He was Mario for like a good week. Okay. He was Mario, and then, oh no, last week he tried to say that his name was Jennifer. It is true. You yeah, did try and call did. yourself my girlfriend. Yep. Hmm. Yep. It's true. Don't deny it. Do not deny it. What? You were probably drunk. Yeah. Exactly. All right. So that we're guy's gonna always drunk. We're gonna move right into our funny news story of the day. I yeah. just scratched myself on this couch. That's and this is where I go to sleep. Cry me a river. Cry me a river. That really hurt too. All right. So. This comes out of Kima, Texas, where a naked unicyclist was charged for distracting drivers. They saw Royce riding down the interstate on a unicycle! Royce, what were you doing in Kima, Texas? It's a good state. Texas, yeah, good gun laws. I like the gun laws there. Yeah. Everything's bigger down there. This, oh, this is true. Everything's bigger down there. Poke the, poke it. Whoever's touching me, the vibrator must stop. That's not a vibrator, bro. What the hell is that? You are imagining things. Things I likes. Anyway, Ugh. police say a man ar was arrested in southeast Texas City for riding his unicycle in the nude and was distracting drivers and creating a hazard. That must have been a sexy dude. <laughs> yeah. Where's my the they honest. said that he was not intoxicated oh, or yes. impaired when he was arrested Wednesday on a bridge in the city 20 miles southeast of Houston, uh, Mr. Farley had been falling off of the unicycle and into traffic. Look out for the dude! <laughs> He's 45, you don't want to kill him! Meow! I wonder what he uses for his turn signal. Uh, you guys are sick, and you're <laughs> laughing about it. What about his hazards? Does he like pick a food? Like... <laughs> sure. All right. Anyway, anyway. <laughs> that got cold. <laughs> yeah. Well, speaking of cold, Farley told the officers that he liked the feeling of riding without his clothes, which were found at the base of the bridge. <laughs> I like the feeling of the wind between my knees. I bet. Why'd you sound like Bora? It did sound a bit, a bit like Bora. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. All right. Nice system. Uh, number two prostitutes of all catches. Yes. Police charged Farley of Clear Lake with misdemeanor indecent exposure. Bond is set at $1,500. Online jail records did not uh, you for list a attorney for Mr. Farley. God! Chicken? Chicken? Boil? He is ready for the pot. I think we shall put him in. Oh! Do you think about cooking me up? <laughs> yes. <laughs> we are also violent. Why can't we all just hug and get along? Hug me, Corey! Of course, those two hug each other. Hug me, Joey! Much better. I got this. We love each other. We're gonna do a group hug after this. Yep. Yay! 
Yay, you guys get special behind the scene footage again. At least an exposure. That would suck. <laughs> and fan service. Causing a distraction. That is a sexy man driving down that thing. Wow. Spikes. 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 Who's that? Who's that man riding on the motorcycle? Joey. 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 I'm a stoner. I think, we should, I think we should get to the unlikely scenario. Yes! Let's jump right into unlikely scenarios. This is where we list scenarios that would probably, most definitely, never happen. And like we don't have to hit me? I haven't hit you yet. That's a good point. So we have paper. Hey, children! I want to stop this fucking car. Oh! I will turn this car around. I don't mind turning around for once. I will turn around. I will like... bend you over in front of a prison. Oh, I'm God. tired of your snake in this motherfucking train. Anyway, let's jump right into. Moving on. <laughs> so one of the scenarios we have here is uh, Edward Cullen and uh, Blade. Who's Edward Cullen again? Twilight. The shiny dude, Cedric Diggory, shiny. Oh no, one I don't know the guy. You, sir, are very fortunate. <laughs> very fortunate man right the here, book, ladies I will and gentlemen. Give, I will give for credit. Valid effort in the books. Poor execution. Valid uh -huh. effort, poor execution. She tried to remake Romeo and Juliet. And it, she did okay, but it ruined vampires. Why? For generations to come. Sparkle. Just why? Because their skin is hard. Let's just say who's gonna Like watch. diamonds. So here's what. I don't here's know. what I think will happen. Blade will show up, break his foot up in his ass, cut him in half, and spread his various body parts across the oceans. That's exactly what's gonna happen. There is no fight involved. Blade versus Edward Cullen. I put my hands down on Blade all day. Blade uh, doesn't give a shit. Got, uh, Most epic black man to walk the earth. We got uh, Optimus Prime and uh, Snooky. Snooky one, smish smish. Who's Snooky again? Jersey Shore. Jersey Shore, oh, you never... uncultured soul. Never seen it. <laughs> Good. The short little Italian will hump his leg. Good sure. for you. It's so, so far, that's two things you guys said that's both good that I haven't seen. The short, tanning chick will hump his leg, and that will solve the world. Fine. Then Little Optimus Prime. How about Tuxedo Mask versus Leatherface? Give me a sec, I'm trying to remember what Leatherface is. Jason Voorhees? Fine. Jason Voorhees and Tuxedo Mask. No, no, I mean, is Leatherface Jason Voorhees? No. Then Jason Voorhees wears a hockey mask. Don't try, don't try. Leatherface carries a chainsaw around. That's why I know Leatherface. Okay. Uh, chainsaw guy. J Texas Chainsaw Massacre? Yes. Okay. Okay. I've never seen a movie, but I know who Leatherface is. Versus Tuxedo Mask. Go. Leatherface all day. Yeah, that's why I'm going to get the Leatherface. You're throwing throws. Just as long you as can you throw your rose at me all you like. Just, just as long as he doesn't throw right. a chair. Huh? You never played the old Atari game. He got, got any? He got stopped by every got single any? damn thing on the screen. Do you have any? Hmm. Oh, I got one. Uh, if it's anything Speedo related, then I'm staying out. What is the. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yoda. Versus a Furby doll. Furby. <laughs> Why? Furbies are evil. <laughs> Yoda's Yoda. Yoda is Yoda. Furbies are the devil. <laughs> Furbies make deals with the devil. I'm doing this toy. You must die now. You will die now. Die now. Die must you now. Die now. But the damn thing will come back to life. It comes back to life. They have microwaved a Furby. Yeah. And it stayed. Coo, coo, coo. And it stayed alive. <laughs> they microwave it. Why is it so many people? I've seen them before. Don't, don't seem like that. Hulk, your father, I be. Very evil. You got any situations? I'd say Roger Rabbit versus the seven, seven evil exes from Scott Pilgrim. I don't know enough about seven. Pizza evil exes. breath. Roger Rabbit. Roger Rabbit, because Roger cart. Rabbit's epic. He's a cartoon. He's and he's married to Jessica Rabbit, the sexiest woman on the face of the planet. True. Almost just about every single guy that's seen that, seen her is always falling for her, so... I don't think they fall for her. Either. I think they want to do her. 
If what? cartoons can be real, I think that Jessica Rabbit will be the first thing on everybody's list. No, she's unfortunate. True. That's like Barbie. That's kind of gross. They probably think Lola from Space Jam. That's a bunny. <laughs> Bestiality. All Someone's program. salty. It is legal in some states still because no one's ever. Tried Co it. Corey turns back. <laughs> <laughs> OMG facts. OMG facts. You would know, want to know about that, wouldn't you? I didn't know about it. It just, <laughs> it just popped up. No. On the home page. And we just lost a cast member. No. 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 <laughs> oh my god. You got kneecapped. Ow. Are you dying? Did that really hurt? No. No? Damn it. I was hoping. Anything else? Oh, I thought. Wait, you want me to do another scenario? No. So who do you think's gonna win? Oh, um. Roger Rabbit. Yeah, as cool as cool and powerful as the X's are, I'm gonna have to say Roger Rabbit because our cartoons are basically God. They have God among men. <laughs> they have God powers. They never die, and they can always pull off just about anything they, they need. And they're dead. what? They're dead. As long as they don't look down when they're, you know, walking in. Why like Cody still lives? Yes. Yeah. Doesn't matter what happens to him. He's always alive. Exactly. All the right. thing is, that's just his the job. Can... Have you seen movies where he just punches in and he goes yeah, to work? Yeah. I'm, I'm aware of it. Right. So now we're going to move into our weekly funnies. This is part of our show where we tell stories that happened during our weeks and we decide amongst ourselves which ones are the most hilarious. And, ladies and gentlemen, for the first time in forever, we actually got somebody who submitted a weekly Holy funny. Holy shit! Hold on, didn't we have that before? Didn't In forever, he mentioned O'Jiggle oh, King. So, this one... So it's, got a, he's, it's got a cast member either. And it's not a cast member either. Woo, 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 woo. I don't even... I actually do not know who this person is. So this is, you know, legit who right be? here. Um, their username. Their username is Super SimSlayer77. Oh, I, I know who that is. Who that is. Super Sin Slayer 77. Chaz. Oh, Charles. Good old boy, Charles. So we All do right. know the guy. So, my weekly funny was when my big brother was pulling glue. He was pulling glue out of my cousin's hair. And she was using it to keep a feather in place, which she had a few days. My uncle offered to cut it with scissors, but he continued to pull on it. When it came out, it was this big strand of hair. Might not be funny, but it'll give us something to talk about. I feel sorry for the tiny. Hmm. Cause that sucks. Big I have had my, I have had things ripped out of my hair before. That sucks. Don't get ideas. That <laughs> sucks. And well, it hurts. I'm guessing I know. I that know. was that was a really you had beard hair. I just realized that's a very hairy situation. <laughs> <laughs> I give it to him. I give it to him. That was, that was close. Alright. <laughs> Alright, so. Good job, Bruce. Alright, no so we're going to start off with Corey as far as a weekly funny. Alright. Hmm. It's not exactly hilarious. You say that every time. And how many you've won whenever you said that? Pretty much every single one. Exactly. No, I understand. Just say something. Everybody's probably gonna pick it anyway. Tenny sprinkles. I don't know. Um, there we go. Tenny sprinkles. No. Uh, I was playing magic with my friend Julius, and he had a healing deck, and he kept getting help and help and help. And I had my black green deck, all about black link and healing myself. So we didn't attack each other really. We just kept getting help and help and help. And you know, I had like 70 health and I brought him down to 60, then he brought me down to 50, and I'm black at 60. It just kept going up and down, up and down, up and down. Not hilarious, but just interesting. And take me forever off. This will be my turn, old loud chewer. I was gonna have one where I was a bleeping rule, but I changed my mind. This weekly funny 
Will it be about time? I found out that daddy long legs are not the most poisonous spiders in the world. Oh. And in fact, they can bite you. What? But. Yep. Just. Hush. Shut up. I was under a house, helping my friend out, installing a dryer vent. Because his was clogged. So I pull this out, and I'm crawling under this guy's house. Damaged my boots in the process. I'm not happy about that. But I'm crawling under this house, and suddenly, I feel something bit me. Right? There! I was wearing coveralls, my knee. So I crawled under my coveralls, up my leg, and bit me. I pull it out, it's a daddy long legs. The suckers can bite you if they're determined. I get out, after I'm done, and I have a pounding headache for three days. Didn't kill me, pounding headache. So, found out that daddy long legs are not the most poisonous spiders in the world. And they can bite you, little bastards. Never Ow. crawling under a wet house again. I must get under skin. Looks too good to resist. Yes, I can do it. Yes, with the power of friendship, I can bite this guy. Nice. Please. He used the words power of friendship. Combined with the power of love. Ah, ah, ah. How's that? Heart. Wind, water, earth. pain, pain, much pain. Yes. Your entrails earth and pain. will become your extrails. That's your weekly funny. Yes. All right. Yes. Move your own intestines. My weekly funny is this. Uh, my friend Brittany and I were hanging out, and she's like, "Hey, you have a treehouse in your backyard." And I'm like, "Yeah." Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> yeah. Right. Anyway, so we. <laughs> Anyway, we. Fuck's sake! Come on, <laughs> come on. Anyway, see us with the rest of your story. So there's like this dead tree behind the tree house, and you know it's been there for like a few years, and you know I figured, you know, hey, you know, for shits and giggles, how about I just push it back and forth and see if I can knock it down. Giggity giggity. I didn't think I would. Knock it down, and you know, when we were realizing, okay, yeah, this thing is gonna come out of the ground, we realized, um, you know, my friend's like, uh, yeah, that's gonna hit the fence. And I'm like, nah, it's not gonna hit the fence. It's, it's just barely short enough to where it won't hit the fence. And so eventually, I push it over, I push it over, I push it over, and finally, the tree topples over. And, the, I swear, it was less than a foot. Less than a foot of the top portion of the tree landed on my neighbor's fence. Oh my god, and that guy from Home Improvement is going to be so mad at you! So we had to saw off that little one foot section so that that little section could fall off and the rest of the tree would fall down to the ground. And now, it is still sitting in my backyard, just laying there to rot. Yeah. Until he wanted to get him some. Yeah, you have the neighborhood so improvements what? and... It's a tree house with a chick! What do you think was gonna happen? Joey, you might use your tree against her bush. Just... There's a snake in your bush. Giggity giggity you! <laughs> no. Royce! Royce, your weekly funny. I think that's gonna win just simply because of our commentary. <laughs> okay, okay. Say that I'm written, my friend. Go! <laughs> You're. We're done! You, you guys go. have a habit of interrupting me whenever I'm starting my weekly funny or saying my weekly funny. Ignore party. these motherfuckers right here. How the... can I when one abuses me? <laughs> okay, that is a valid <laughs> argument, but still. Try no, to continue, animals. please. Okay. This is about animals? <laughs> no. Okay. Not, not, re not reality. Okay. Okay. So, I don't know if anybody else will find this funny, but I found it funny. I was actually playing Super Smash Brothers with Charles, the one that sent in his movie funny earlier. So, we're practicing because we were going to go over to uh, somebody's house and play Smash with them. So, we're practicing, practicing our team combos, and whenever I play fighting, I'm a reckless idiot. So, 
I'm playing as Mario, he's Sonic, and we're going against a team of Jigglypuffs. I see one off the edge, I go out, I'm about to spike it, he comes up, I spike both him and Jigglypuff, and I also kill myself. We're both, we're both on the reviving platforms, I'm apologizing to him profusely, and then we look back to the screen, and we see Sonic just giving Mario just a stern look, and Mario's like, sorry. And that's it. Wow. <laughs> so, every one of ours basically involved life or death. Pretty much. Is right. the act of creating life? Oh! Uh -huh! Really? <laughs> Christ. <laughs> Alright, who wins? Who wins? Alright, so, yeah. is it Corey with his magic story? Uh, Miguel with his... Spider. Spider, yes. That Spider is Man. story. Spider. Me with my dead tree story. Or Royce with his Super Smash Brothers, Su Super Smash Brothers story. Find or out next time. Or Charles. Yeah. Charles with his uh, cousin and the trying. strand of hair having to be trying. taken out. Can I leave it on cliffhanger? Uh, no. I know who wins. I think I know who you're gonna say. So who wins? I know his answer already. Joey. <laughs> What's your who, who's who's Royce's? Royce! Alright, okay. What about you, my man? I'm going with mine. That that moment was just too funny. <laughs> Royce wins. Alright, yeah! So, Curse. Royce, you win! Oh, well, you win again! <laughs> Sweet! Crisis! With a Super Mario Smash Brothers story. The mirror about giving birth was special. Anyway, that does it for this Mother episode Earth. of Zoo and Mother Mush. Earth! I must worship Mother Earth! This side of the couch, I, I tell you. All right, hey, that's everybody's favorite characters on the show. No, no, no. Remember, guys, you can submit your weekly funnies in the comments below. You can message us on Facebook. You can email us at zumgoosh at gmail.com. Gmail. You better do it, dadgummit! Yes. I'm tired All of having right. my friends do it. Exactly. We want someone that is, doesn't know us. Exactly. Please. You, so, Scandinavian man who watches us butt ass naked. Exactly! You Submit, must do it! Submit your weekly funny in Scandinavian, and we will try to translate it using Google Translator. And if we miss you some of your words in a horrible translation, we apologize ahead of time. I don't. Anyway, that does it for this episode of ZOM Goosh. I'm Joe Trask. You got the wrong. I'm Corey. Uh. What? What's your name, motherfucker? Fine. We'll see you guys next week. Go! Joey wants to. Joey wants to have some fun time in the bushes. Good going, Joey! Woo, 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 woo. Joey.